Good afternoon, everyone. I'm absolutely delighted to be here again at Goldridge House. Uh, it was about a month ago, four or five weeks ago, when I came down for interview and met the people behind Goldridge House for the first time. And they are really just the most incredible group of people in terms of their skills and their experience, uh, but really the, the passion uh, and dedication to this particular project is just phenomenal. They have a very, very particular vision for this school. And one of the things that really struck me when I applied for the job and when uh, I then took on the role um, was how very closely their views uh, were aligned with my own. Uh, what we care about are very much the same things. Um, it's about returning to uh, a rigorous style of uh, education uh, that's very much tailored to the individual, that is aspirational, aspire is to be our school motto, uh, and aspires for every single individual in the school, um, whatever your abilities. Um, it's about building confidence and offering opportunities to develop confidence. And this is something we really uh, hold dear and are... Um, absolutely wanting to be at the centre of what it is um, that makes this school special. Uh, we aim to be outstanding, um, we want that right from the start. Um, at the moment I am, I suppose, the sole employee of the school, I'm the only person who's actually been put in post and I'm headmistress designate, um, but it is part of my uh, very enjoyable task, I'm sure, uh, to start to set up uh, the teaching staff and the other administrative and support staff at the school. Um, and we'll be looking for very great quality amongst those individuals. This is because, um, as boys and girls, I'm sure you want the best experience that you can. Um, you'll be asking yourself, you know, what are my classes going to be like? Well, one of the things we'll aim for are smaller class sizes of 20 to 24 pupils maximum, um, in which you will be enriched and challenged, uh, be offered targets that you will be encouraged towards. Um, we, we need the teachers who are going to be able to fulfill that uh, on your behalf. Um, also, you'll be wanting to know about our extended day. Uh, for instance, the opportunities to undertake uh, uh, preparation, as we call it, or perhaps homework, independent study, using our facilities immediately after school. And also, quite excitingly, our enrichment programme, which we, uh, again, would expect our teachers to contribute towards, but we'd also buy into other sorts of coaching and training to have this very broad curricular offer, uh, extracurricular offer, which goes on until five o'clock. So pupils will be expected to um, participate fully in that day, and the teachers will be expected to help provide that and be part of that ethos for the school. It's an ethos that would also offer, as well as academic excellence and as well as um, excellence in terms of extracurricular, opportunities for leadership as well. So your sons and daughters, who of course will be the leaders to a certain extent, they will always be the pioneers who will bring through that vision. Uh, of Gildridge House. They will always be the, the form captains, uh, the captains of sport, um, the people who will participate in the school council. All of these different leadership opportunities will develop their skills and their confidence as they progress through the school and represent the school in the district and beyond. So really today for you is about Having a look at the school, uh, we're exceptionally um, pleased that we've managed to secure this particular site for the school. Um, and I think you will see as you walk around that undoubtedly it offers amazing potential for development. Uh, some of it immediately, I'm sure you'll be able to imagine as school classrooms and school rooms. Um, others you'll perhaps need to use your imagination on, but I think undoubtedly you will see that there are areas that can be developed uh, in really new and exciting ways. So please, I urge you, have a look at the school very thoroughly. Uh, you'll have the opportunity to meet some of these uh, amazing individuals uh, behind the school. 
either during the tour, because they're taking you around, or afterwards when we all converge at the Heaver Room, which is in the spectacular Master's House, which you've passed on the way in. I'll be there as well, so if I haven't had an opportunity yet to talk to you, uh, then I hope that I'll have an opportunity for some individual uh, conversations with you, and you can ask me any questions then. So I look forward to meeting you again later. Thank you.